A cemetery can be an interesting place to visit. You might learn bits of local history by reading what's written on the tombstones. You will definitely be intrigued if you walk around Shankill Cemetery in Lurgan, Ireland and read the following on a gravestone. Margory McCall, lived once, buried twice. Apparently, this lady Margory died of a fever in 1695. Probably out of fear that the fever was contagious, a brief wake was held, and she was promptly buried. On her finger was a valuable ring that her husband couldn't remove because her hands were too swollen due to the illness. That very same night, grave robbers dug up the body and also unsuccessfully tried to remove Marguerite's ring from her finger. They decided to cut off the finger instead. With the first cut, blood flowed from her finger, and Marguerite woke up from the coma she was in. She suddenly sat up and screamed loudly. Can you blame the grave robbers for choosing to run in fear? Margory then climbed out of her grave, dusted herself off, and walked home. At home, she knocked on the front door. Her husband and children were sitting around the table when she knocked. The man said to his children, if she wasn't dead and buried, I could swear it's your mother knocking there. It's right at this point that various versions of the story have emerged. In one version, her husband opens the door, sees his, dead, wife standing there, and drops dead from shock. He is buried in Marguerite's grave the next day. Marguerite remarries and has another child with her new husband in the following ten years. In another version, the man was indeed shocked, who wouldn't be, and turned snow white overnight. They had one more child before Marguerite passed away in 1705. Another version suggests that the grave robbers scared themselves to death. All these different versions make one wonder about the authenticity of the story. The fact that versions of the story, with different names for the victim, appear in several European countries does make for serious doubt. Could identical events have occurred in countries like the Netherlands, Germany, France, Italy, Scotland, England, and Canada?